All right, so I'm in the 2018 Chevy Impala. I'm in the Premier trim, which is the top trim. I did a review of this vehicle when it was first redesigned. From a design standpoint, it still looks very modern. It hasn't aged. It looks like it would be modern for the next few years. Now, there's a tale of two cities with this vehicle. When I first reviewed it a few years back, it was beautiful inside nice decor nice quality materials great design comfortable luxurious but the driving dynamics were terrible and the seat i could never get the seat right so this 2018 model basically what happens when a vehicle is released sort of in a working test phase and they they'll adapt or they'll change slightly little things. Over time, they've really done a good job. This is a very comfortable vehicle. Um, in the Premier line, so it has the V6. Beautiful, smooth, powerful, man style. I say man style a lot, and that's probably not good, right? I should say female. Women style, woman style. I like woman style, I like woman style. <laughs> Sitting in this vehicle, you do feel, I, at least I feel like I'm in a luxury car. We've got contrast piping here on this leather seat. So there's a beige piping element here. Beige contrast stitching. Soft touch materials everywhere. It's got the uh, hidden compartment behind the touchscreen display, which is always a novelty. and. At night, there's a there's ambient lighting in and around the dash, in the door cards. Just well done, comfortable vehicle. If you're looking for a mid-size to full-size car, you should put the Impala on your list, guys, because they have um, they've sorted it out. I've driven this on an 18-hour <laughs> trip. And it's, it's, it's performed like a champ. The exterior of the Impala ah, is beautiful. To me, beautifully done. Just elegant, it's got a muscular look to it. Again, it's been in this same form for a few years now and it still looks, whoever designed the Impala, should get a gold star because it's it defies the test of time you could have this car you buy this car in 2018 and it'll look new if you keep it you take care of it it'll look new for years beautiful ultra large trunk great room in the back nice bench seat back here comfortable I've got my GoPro ready for some road footage I'm feeling no pain, feeling no pain. This by far is one of the top choices. If you get the Premier or the upper trim level, the interior of the Impala is just, it's just luxurious, guys. It's luxurious for a Chevy. Beautiful. Research told me a while back that you guys wanted shorter videos. Now research is telling me that you guys want longer videos, so I'm just talking. This is a new format. I'm sitting here talking. I'm not going to run around the car and push it and do all that crazy stuff. I'm just having a conversation with you, and it's going to be over 10 minutes. Yeah. Anything else? Let's see. What else? It's a beautiful car. Buy the car. On the downside, because people have said I'm too nice about things, I'm going to come up with my nits. The vehicle has a short turning radius, so if you're trying to maneuver in a tight spot, it may not be the, the best vehicle for that. But other than that, the driving dynamics have been greatly improved. Out on the highway, you've got, at least in this model with the V6 engine, you have tons of power for passing. You're essentially driving a Camaro. I believe it shares 
the V6 engine with the Camaro. Now, I'm sure you, someone will tell me I'm stupid and I don't know what I'm talking about, so. But I, in my mind, it shares the V6 of the, of the Camaro. It's like a Camaro with four doors. It's a Camaro with four doors where you can see. Oh, I'm in Florida this week. And when I landed in Florida and I had a few options, I looked at this. It's a beautiful, like, pewter teal. And I saw that it was the premiere. Cut above. I said, I'm, I'm, it, I'm getting it. Beautiful vehicle. Buy the damn vehicle. Buy it. Accident avoidance features. So you have your blind spot monitoring or blind spot mirror here, which is great. So when you're out on the highway or anywhere and a car is in your blind spot or approaching, you know, from behind where you can't see them on either mirror, you'll get a flash. You can also have an audible warning that there is something in your blind spot, which is great. Backup cam, which is standard today. Anything 2018 and above, a backup camera is standard equipment, which is, I've been, I've been suggesting for years, all vehicles need a backup camera, especially Jeeps. Now for you millennial types, who can't go anywhere without their phones and their Wi-Fi, you have Wi-Fi in this vehicle speech to text and all kinds of goodies and for old people like me and pedro real buttons and knobs along with the infotainment center and by the way pedro where the hell are you i'm missing you brah where are you i know you're watching me and you're not commenting i love the 2018 chevy impala i love the exterior design I love the driving dynamics, the comfort of it, the mega huge trunk that you can put all kinds of stuff in. It's it's a no-brainer. If you're looking for a sedan, mid-size sedan, I guess it's listed as a mid-size or a full-size sedan, you should definitely put this on your test drive list, guys. And I'm in sunny Florida this week, and I'm going home tomorrow, and I'm not happy about it. It's snowing. As always, I want to thank you guys for watching. I'll be back with more reviews. Yeah. Push and play.